What's up guys, this is iTweets here, and today I'm going to be showing you a tweet called Little Brother. So this tweak is actually going to be for smaller screen devices. You can see that I have my iPhone 5S right here. This is also going to work on your iPhone 5, 5C, anything like that. It's not something you probably want to download if you have an iPhone 6 Plus. Now what this tweet does is basically change the resolution of your device. So it's going to give you that option that you usually see in your iPhone 6 Plus where you change from either standard to zoomed. So this is actually going to give you three options. So if we jump into uh, our settings right here, you can see we tap on little brother and it goes directly into display zoom. So you have large, which is actually the default, which is what we have right now. And you can see you uh, can see three rows and then just like an extra third. Now if we go to medium, you can see that we actually get a almost a full four rows. You can't see the very bottom of the text, but you can see all of the icons right there. And then you can actually jump into small right here, which you can see you get a pop-up that basically says unsupported mode, and really you don't want to use this just because you get some massive glitches that makes the device, uh, it doesn't make it unusable, but you're not going to want to use it. It basically gives you glitches down here at the very bottom, almost an entire row of the screen about the size of the dock, and the same right up here at the top that basically, I mean, you're not going to want to use this option. So what you're going to want to use is the medium option if you want to change the resolution of your smaller screen device. So right here you can see that we also have two toggles which allow us to go into landscape mode on the home screen as well as landscape mode on the lock screen right here. So of course I have those both toggled on so I'll show you what those are right after we respring. Now of course you see the little page dots right here which is basically just allowing you to swipe over just like you can in the normal uh, iPhone 6 setting when you're choosing between zoom or standard. So once you decide which display zoom you want to use, which I'm going to be using medium, we're just going to tap set and then you just tap use medium right there and it's going to respring the device. And then once it respring, you're going to see just how much smaller or how much real estate you have on your springboard. And it's actually pretty nice. Now this is going to allow you to use uh, applications in that resolution as well, in some applications. Now it's not going to work on all applications, but First of all, you'll notice that obviously our apps are much, much smaller. So you'll notice that we can actually go into landscape mode as well. Now if we open up settings right there, you can see that we do have landscape support in the settings application. And like I said, this is not going to work uh, for every application. Not every application has uh, landscape support. So you'll see right here if we try to open up the app store that we're not going to get landscape support right here. And not only do we not have landscape support, but it's actually the same size as it was before. So it doesn't even change the resolution in this application. So this is just something you're gonna have to tinker with to find out which applications it actually works in and which they don't work in. So let's go back here to the lock screen and you'll see right here, that we'll go ahead and unlock it and then go into landscape mode and you can see you have landscape support for the lock screen as well. So a really cool tweak, I highly recommend checking this out if it's something that you're looking for if you're not on iPhone 6 or iPhone 6 Plus. Alright guys, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, you can go ahead and subscribe. Alright, until next time, peace.